Hey, this is Greg over at DIY RV and Home. Got a little project here, something to add a little color to a desk, table, uh, centerpiece, uh, even at your campsite or something like that. If you're in a travel trailer or something like that, and you want to add some color of flowers, but yet don't want to have to be watering the flowers all the time or anything like that. This, this is something that would be fun to do. Um, very inexpensive. We were at the dollar store and we found these clay pots and that's what kind of got it uh, our ideas going on what we were going to do we picked up uh, some flowers fake flowers peat moss and some miniature clothes pins uh, one of the other things that we're going to add to it is this uh, foam that you use for uh, your uh, flowers and stuff like that we're going to add some of that to it uh, pretty much the tools that we're going to need is going to be the a glue gun and a utility knife so here we go. First thing we're gonna go ahead and get some of this foam out so we can size it. And I think what I'm gonna to try to do is just give it a little press like that. That works really nice. And then we'll go ahead and trim it. Now we got the basic shape. Go ahead and figure out where we want to cut it. And start trimming it to fit. getting there I think that's about perfect for the size Get that mess out of the way. Okay, now we're going to take a flower. See if we can't just get one of them. You could if you wanted to use all of them. I am just going to use a single. So I'm going to come in. I'm actually going to Slice on the plastic. Should be able to pull. On this to, well. Let's just say it worked on the other plant that I, that I had. Or the other fake flower. There we go. Just need to slice just a little bit further. Okay. So now we've got a flower. Let's find one that works. There we go. That one looks a little bit better. That's the nice thing about these flake, fake flowers is We can move them around, play with them. Okay. So now we're going to take and shoot that right through the center. Here we 
go. That looks like a good height too for what I'm wanting to do. So I'll just bend it over. that'll work I think that'll work really nice you can bring it you can put your leaf wherever you want so well what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and glue that actually into place with some hot glue Just a little bit more right there. Let that sit for a second. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to take one of these. Add some more hot glue to this, to one side, and then we'll go ahead and attach it to the flower. About like that. dry a bit. I'll even add a little bit more to it just to make sure she's not going to go anywhere. Now as we're letting that dry, cool off, and set. If we want to, which I'm going to go ahead and do, is I'm going to take some of this, a little bit of this peat moss, and I'm just going to add it to the top of this just to kind of hide that foam. Yeah, just a little bit of ground cover there. We can drop that back down. We can put it wherever we want. Now I'm going to see if I can't take some of this excess glue and remove it. That feels pretty good. So there, that's pretty much it. And what you can do is you can take your uh, a photo or something that something like you really like, put on that, and there it is. The project cost uh, approximately, I'd say, four dollars to do, um, and I had enough material I could do. Um, I think the um, Little pots came uh, in uh, a six pack, so I was able to do. Uh, you know, I could do six of these. Hope you guys enjoyed the project. 
Uh, hope to see you on the next video. If you liked it, please share, subscribe, and like. Guess I'm cleaning up while I'm talking. Hope to see you on the next video.